Saravanan lives in Uti and runs a business that gathers people for politicians and events. One day, he meets Maya and falls for her. However, RDX Rajaseka also loves her. Saravanan convinces Rajaseka not to love Maya by saying she is too high class. Rajaseka is a police inspector. Due to several mishaps, he is fired and starts working as a hotel doorman. He is shocked to find Saravanan and Maya going out together. He asks Saravanan how he made Maya fall in love with him. As Saravanan finishes his story, it reveals that Saravanan indirectly caused those mishaps that led to Rajaseka's firing. Enraged, Rajaseka hires Kumaran, a specialist in breakups. Kumaran then sends a woman to cause conflict in Saravanan and Maya's relationship. Due to his love failure, Saravanan becomes drunk and falls unconscious. Kumaran, also at the bar, drops Saravanan off at his house. Savanan's mother, Thulazi, ashamed of his behavior, sends him to meet his father, Alavanthan, and younger brother, Shakthi, in Madurai. There, they meet Alavanthan and rejoin him. They discover that Kumaran is also the son of Alavanthan's ex-lover. Alavanthan reveals to his sons that they have three aunts, Periyaponu, Nadu Ponu, and Chinaponu. Alavanthan wants his sons to marry the daughters of their aunts so that their families can reunite. Once and for all, a reluctant Saravanan helps his brothers and father attend a temple function in disguise to kidnap and marry their cousins. But they kidnap their aunts. They run away before getting caught. Saravanan agrees to the plan after discovering that Periyaponu's daughter is Maya. Periyaponu believes Pasupathi, the MLA and ex-servant of Alavanthan's family, committed the kidnapping. Periyaponu decides to run against him in the next election. Pasupathi sends men to kill the aunts. But the brothers save them, disguised as police officers. Using this disguise, the trio gains access to their aunt's house. There, their uncles help facilitate the brothers' affection for their daughters. The trio succeeds in gaining the daughters' love. Pasupathi provokes Periyaponu by wagering that if he loses to her, he will work at her home as a servant. But if she loses, her daughter Maya will marry his son. Using his knowledge of politics, Saravanan helps his aunt gain popularity. However, a few days before the elections, the aunts find out that Savanan's father is their brother Alavanthan, whom they believe killed their father. Their hatred towards Alavanthan results in them getting Saravanan and his brothers arrested. His sister's harsh words hurt Alavanthan. He suffers a heart attack and becomes hospitalized. While Saravanan and his brothers are in jail, his aunt loses popularity due to Pasupathi's devious manipulation. Saravanan calls Rajaseka, who bails out the brothers and exposes Pasupathi's dirty tricks. To avoid defeat, Pasupathi tries to bribe people to vote for him. But Saravanan and Kumaran foil his plan, giving Periyaponu the edge. Pasupathi arrives at the home to kill the family and take Maya. But Maya has already escaped to elope with Saravanan. Saravanan, though, insists they go back. A furious Pasupathi reveals that he was the one who killed Alavanthan's father. Not Alavanthan. He attacks Periyaponu just as Maya and Saravanan return. Saravanan fights Pasupathi and his son. At last. When Pasupathi goes to get his men, he finds that all the men assembled are Savanan's gang members, which defeats him. The family reunites and celebrates the three brothers' weddings with their cousins.